Hey there guys, welcome back to the channel. Thanks so much for watching today. Today we are back with another Funko Pop unboxing for you. This time we have the entire set for the brand new Target exclusive Star Wars Retro Series Pops. Ones that I've definitely been looking forward to. I think they put them up for pre-order, I want to say back in June or July. Uh, we finally were able to get them in uh, recently. So definitely excited to go ahead and show them off today. Got my Kylo Ren holographic shirt on which is really cool. But before we get into it, make sure you guys go down below and hit that subscribe button. Go ahead and leave a like on the video as well. It really does help us out and very much appreciate it. So in this set, there have been four different pops uh, that have been able to come out. I think at first I was able, able to order three of them and I got one recently on a restock. So I finally have all four in. So I'm definitely excited to go ahead and show them off. And these are definitely really, really cool ones. Probably some of my favorite Star Wars ones that have been released recently because of the look. And our first one that we have from this line is going to be, of course, none other than Luke Skywalker. Now, first off, you can kind of tell for, by, the, by the box, this is definitely a really cool look. So it's actually going to be based off of some of the 1980s Star Wars comics. So we kind of have here on the back where we see that uh, comic book back from the 80s, uh, it says July 1980 Star Wars number one, where it's definitely that great look, and so you kind of see that some of the colors represented here on the box, which looks great. I love when the box is different, it has some of that great box art, so definitely really cool there. And then the figure itself definitely has a lot of detail in it too, with kind of the glow and some of the colors in there. They definitely make it look a little bit different compared to some of the other Star Wars ones. And it does have a newer mold than some of the other Luke Skywalker pops too. So that's definitely really great to see. So the pop kind of makes it look like it is Luke from A New Hope. Kind of that white robe on there with his lightsaber. Now the lightsaber is red, uh, which is interesting uh, color there. Seeing as he never actually sports the red one. But I think when you kind of light it up, it does change that color a little bit, which is pretty cool. And you see the white and kind of blue and black. So it does make it look like it's a comic book drawing. So you can even see kind of where his cheekbones would be. So it kind of gives him a little bit of definition as well. So definitely really great. And I do like the detail in the hair as well. So yeah, when you, again, when you take another look at the pop and then we take a look at the back, what it's based off of with that comic, you can see, you see the blue and the black kind of based in there on the uh, on his robes there so really cool to see with the red lightsaber so definitely really great uh, you know adaption of the comic book cover right into this pop so that's great addition to this retro series and then the next one that we have from this series is going to be his friend C-3PO and he definitely looks cool everyone loves C-3PO from the movies right but this is going to be based off of the comic and it's going to be from The Empire Strikes Back. So there is a look at The Empire Strikes Back comic book. Definitely really cool. With C-3PO kind of holding Luke in his hands while surrounded by Stormtroopers. Definitely great one. And then again, the box kind of looking similar, but has C-3PO's colors in there. And the pop itself definitely has a lot of great definition as well. So you have C-3PO's gold all over. His eyes are kind of a little bit of a different shade of gold too, which makes it different, which is great and kind of the black shadowing all over him as well and you even see just a little bit of detail of kind of like some orange on the top of his head where the back and the front of his head kind of click in together so definitely really cool where the paneling would be protected so i do actually really like this c3po pop as well and actually one of the only uh, c3po um, pops i even have in my collection right now so this is definitely a welcome addition and our third one we have from this line is going to be the stormtrooper now this one of course a classic stormtrooper still going to be based off of the same comic book art as we saw right there on the back so we have all the stormtroopers surrounding c-3po and luke and so definitely a really great look from the empire strikes back i like the shading all over the pop it's kind of the white and blue with the black and white shadings all over the helmet and on the arms and legs definitely great looking look now i think the sculpt might be a little bit close to some of the other more recent stormtroopers that we have had but still definitely looks a lot different within this retro series so i really dig it and our last one that we got from the star wars retro series is going to be 
our boy Darth Vader. Now this one is probably going to be probably the best of the bunch in my opinion right up there with Luke Skywalker. And what this one is going to be based off of is this battle with Darth Vader to the death Marvel comic back from the 80s as well. Looks really awesome. Look at that art with Darth Vader kind of looming over like a looming presence. And he definitely gives that look on it as well. I really like the detail on this and this is probably my favorite from the set. I really like how it's that kind of dark blue and lighter blues kind of mixed in with it as well. Really looks like a drawing for sure. And look at those red eyes. It kind of even looks like it's a little bit lava in the eyes the way that it's shaded. Definitely looks super, super cool. And again, right from the comic. So I like how they did this a little bit different. It's not just based off of movie. It's based off of that iconic retro comic series. Definitely really awesome Darth Vader. Probably one of my favorite Darth Vaders that I have in my collection. And there's our look at the brand new Target exclusive Star Wars retro series pops. I do really like how the Luke Skywalker is a little bit more of an updated mold. I think this Darth Vader one is actually the same mold as the more recent uh, Darth Vader with doing the Force Choking that he had with the Funko Shop exclusive that was released over the summer. But it's still really cool with some of the different coloring in there. And I love the eyes, how they have those red eyes rather than being just kind of the black eye. I think that's definitely a really cool one. So I think that's my favorite out of the set. But I do want to hear from you guys. What do you think about these four Star Wars Retro Series Pops? Which one is your favorite? Also, let me know if you guys were able to pick it up from Target. I know they're starting to hit Target stores, but I got these in the mail with some pre-orders. So I'm definitely excited to have them in my collection well put up on my Star Wars wall. I want to hear what your guys' thoughts are in the comments down below. And of course, if you can, and if you enjoy the video, leave a like and go ahead hit that subscribe button if you are new. Helps us keep growing. We're almost there to 1,300 subscribers. Uh, and let's keep growing here. Let's see if we can get to 2,000 sometime. Uh, I would love to do that. But thank you guys so much for the support. And thank you so much for watching today. And as always, we'll see you again real soon.